Wait, is this Pokestar Studios? Wait. I have to because that unlocks. Bruh. Two thousand years later. Okay, bye. I hated every second of this and I never want to come back. Bye. What is the word of the herd, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the newest episode of our randomized Black 2 Nuzlocke run-through. We'll quickly go over a team recap before we go start to tackle the gym. We've got our newly acquired Justice, the Sand Shrew, our ground-type relaxed Pokemon with Tinted Lens as the ability, Fury Cutter, Poison Sting, Rollout, Rapid Spin, and then we've got Hawk the Whalmer, Water-type Pokemon with Unaware, Astonish, Whirlpool, Water Gun, Rollout with the Bashful Nature. And then our naughty Dusknor, named after Lex, the ghost type Pokemon with the rivalry ability with Bind Foresight, Nightshade, and Astonish. We do have a Shadow Claw TM in the back that we can use for later. Last episode, we ended up clearing out the Burbank City Complex. This episode, we're going to be going into the gym. We should be just about on par with this gym. And the other practicing inside, but please feel free to challenge all of them. You should also stay. Okay, he was just going to give me. I was about to say, I, I don't think there's anything else I could even do in the city. Um, I don't know how many trainers there are. I, think, I mean, last time there was only two. Oh, so I, okay, I think I have to battle these two. Okay, they're just doing sound. Okay, so there we go. That makes more sense. But our episode is primarily just going to be fighting this gym, and maybe we might end up going and doing something else, like maybe another encounter. I doubt that, but it's possible. So it looks like we're going to be right about on par with where we're at um, on levels. My goal is to get Sancher leveled up throughout this while we are fighting some Pokemon that we don't have to worry about as much. Um, I am going to go for some sustained damage on this Blastoise, so I am going to go for Bubble. Or not Bubble. I'm reading the attack he is using. I am going to use Whirlpool. Because then the whole stuck in a vortex thing will get some sustained damage. It'll help us knock it out a little bit quicker. Um, but other than that, I think I'm going to lock ourselves in a rollout. It's not going to have anything. Yeah, it's, it's not going to have anything to really do a whole bunch of damage to me. So I feel like rollout's just going to be the best call. It's got bubble, water gun, tail whip, and withdraw. So I'm really not worried too much about this Blastoise's moveset when it comes to fighting our Whalmer. Did that just say it was freed? I hope not. Okay, thank you for finally hitting. Um, a nice crit. We got some sustain damage. It should only take about two or three more rollouts, and then Blastoise will be gone. And then odds are we'll probably end up switching back out into Justice, so then he can get a little bit more experience. Um, just in case he ends up learning some useful moves, like if he ends up learning a good ground type move, that, that would be really good for us to deal with like some electric and some other typings, like some steel. I would definitely appreciate him learning a couple better moves, but instead we got a Breloom coming out, so hopefully you're not Arena Trap or anything like that, because I'm going to switch out into Justice, and then I'm going to switch directly out into our Dusknor. If I have Ornberries, I'm going to save them for the Gym Leader fight. I don't want to waste them in these fights, because I'm not too overly concerned with these. Leech Seed is going to be a little bit annoying, but I'm not gonna not gonna fret too much about it. Um, I might be able to offset the Leech Seed healing with the Bind um, sustain damage. Let's see how much this does. Healed him to full, so just about. I just about negate it. Wait, did it just say absorb doesn't affect me?
Why would Absorb not affect me? And we avoided the attack. I'm very confused as to what all just happened right there. I'm going to heal up real quick, though, because it is doing a good amount of damage to me. Um, oh, 80 points. Oh, definitely not. I'm definitely not using you. What? I use the fresh water because they give me one of those every single time. I could have just used a potion, but this will just get me back up to full. I have some paralyzed heals and such. So I can use one of those. Hopefully we don't get full parad because this nightshade should kill. And just like I said, we're going to end up getting full parad because I have the worst luck when it comes to status effects. It's going to have twice in a row, watch. Called it! Dude, he's going to heal back up to full before I can get another attack off. Thank you. And the bind wore off, so that's not affecting him anymore. I'm just going to try to end it. I'm going to, I'm going to click Nightshade. Okay, there you go. We get we finally break through. I called that freaking double para. Are you serious? Solid level 20. We are two levels away from learning Shadow Sneak, which is going to be very beneficial overall for us to know it's gonna be another nice move and it'll be dealing more damage because the moves we got right now that we're using kind of doo-doo kind of doo-doo thank goodness they gave us this parahill so now we can just do that So we'll battle you, we'll go back and heal, and then we'll come back and we'll battle the gym leader. This might either end up being a shorter episode or we might go do some encounters. I'm not sure exactly what I'm feeling. But those are the two options we got in front of us. Burmy, not too worried about, but you are su oh, you're super effective to both my Pokemon. But I feel like Hawk has a much better chance of fighting you than Justice does. Just because Hawk is so much... It, it's just beefy. Not gonna, not gonna do a whole bunch, but we could try to just like go for Paras. Man, if you were Serene Grace, that would have been lovely. But I don't even know if they really had it, even had like a stab move or anything. All we've seen is protect and tackle so far, and we outspeed anyway, so we're just gonna hit this and move on with our lives and not worry about this Burmy ever again. Corsola. We'll switch out into Justice, switch back out, just so then Justice gets a little bit of XP. And then I think we might lead with Justice going into the Gym Leader fight. It's because he's the one that's most on par. Our other two Pokemon are a little bit overleveled, from what I can tell. This should be neutral because you're Water Rock. So we should be good just watering it to death. And Whirlpool will give us some nice, consistent damage going on. Perfect, perfect. We'll just start spamming some water guns and get you out of our lives. You know recover. I think I'm going to click roll up. I'm going to click roll up. This Nuzlocke run is the most I've clicked rollout in any Pokemon game ever. Not not even like just in Nuzlocke's. In any Pokemon game, I barely use rollout even in like a normal Pokemon run through. I, I just, I don't like it. I know it's a really strong move. I know it's decent, but I literally almost never use this move. I just, I, mm -mm. Too risky. Too risky. I don't like it. Okay, let's go heal. Fun fact, did you guys know that um, the gym leader in pretty much every single language spells out Pokemon in this game? But in Japanese, I believe she spells out Kopping's name. Useless fun fact for you. I've never played through this game, but that's... That's a random fact that I've heard, and for whatever reason, my brain just takes dumb facts and <laughs> sucks them right in. 
keeps them in for storage just so then I can tell you guys that Aragorn broke his toe every time we watched the two towers. Every single time. So we're just going to leave Justice going into this um, fight. We do have some super potions. We have a good amount of heals. We have a lemonade. We have a means to an end to get through this. Hopefully it's well and good enough to do so. K-E-M-O-N. All right, let's go. Jim fight number two against Roxy. I know that's a guitar, but why does it look like she had a club with freaking hammers in it? Or nails, hammers in it, what am I saying? You are level 18. I didn't realize it was gonna be like that, my bad. Let me switch out. Okay, that was a crit, so I, I should be good to go for rollout. And you're what, bug flying? Wait, no, are you psychic flying? What is this? Did you just get back-to-back -back crits and I just locked myself in a rollout? Don't crit, man. Wait, you missed. Okay. Let's talk about this. Wait, do we out do we outspeed you? Or did we get locked into an extra turn? Okay, we outspeed you. Okay, that makes more sense. I thought we got locked into an extra turn. I thought we missed, and then they just got a free confusion, and we weren't allowed to move. Which I was going to get upset. Saw the super potion coming, but that means we get two free rollouts to stack up the damage, so I'm not going to complain, because that means this next one will... You have protect. Of course you do. Why wouldn't you? Why, 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 why wouldn't you? Why, why would you not have protect? It's fine. This time, we will finish you. This time, we'll finish you. Thank you! Good lord! Yes, oh, finally. Okay, stab move. Thank you. Stab magnitude. It's a dice roll move, but I'll take it. Combi, are you kidding me? You know bug bite? Oh, the ho -ho! I took way too many dice rolls in that entire fight. Why am I suddenly addicted to click and roll out? Okay, up to level 30. We take the Venus Shock. Oh man, my heart. Please don't tell me that's that's forced. Please don't tell me I have to do the Pokestar videos. Please. I was really hoping that was something I could skip. Do we have to do a fight at Pokestar videos? I'm not counting that for my Nuzlocke if I do have to do a fight there. I'm just, I'm just throwing that one out there. Okay, I don't think it is, because that the area up is clear. I don't want to go do the Pokestar videos. That is the last thing. I want to do and then if it does end up being a required thing we'll either worry about it later or I'll do it off screen because I don't know what that is when it doesn't it sounds like forced it sounds like being forced into a contest and I'm, I'm not vibing with it man but we get an encounter here wait wait is this Pokestar Studios
Wait. I have to because that unlocks. Yeah, I have to I have to do this because it then unlocks the uh I'm speeding up. It unlocks the next city. That's what the boat's for. That's that's why the captain's so important. Dude, why do they make this such a, a forced part of this? It, it doesn't... Doesn't make sense. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Skip, skip, skip. <laughs> it is, it's so corny. It's not nice to do bad things. Cringe. Cringe. Boy, I just realized people left the audience. <laughs> Oh, please. Please to- okay, thank goodness. No, don't make me. Don't make me. No! <laughs> I'm being kidnapped! Oh my god, I don't care. Okay, bye! <laughs> Don't make me. Wait, what do I what do I have to do? What do I have to do? Why'd that come out so whiny? What? Uh rental Pokemon, yes, okay. There we go. I'll just rent Pokemon because then it doesn't count because I don't own these anyways. Force palm. Get out of my face. Volibi. And ice punch. Let's get out of here. Release me. Release me. Sure, release it. Oh, do I have to watch it if I release it? I should have just said no. Okay, bye. I hated every second of this and I never want to come back. Bye. Jesus Christ. Oh, man. Get me out of here. Get me out out of here let it, let's go get to the next city before we get roped into something like that again i do i do not want oh oh it was popping all right team plasma let's go let's get into it i'll take you on i got a sand shoe with magnitude now homie Hopefully whatever Pokemon you have is good for that because I would like to use it. Willipup. Yeah, it's okay. Level 15. I'm well and over leveled for that. Go after a nice magnitude. Magnitude 9, first roll! Let's go! Get out! Stab magnitude 9. Easy. Easy. Easy peasy, like peeling a potato. Appreciate you giving me cut. I'll take that kindly. I assume I can use it.
Oh, wait, we have to go track them down? Okay, I guess we're doing some plasma stuff for this episode. I mean, I doubt this will take more than about 10 minutes, so... Sure, why not? I am, unfortunately, going to have to teach Pokemon Cut, but... Could be worse, I guess. Oh, there's an item down here. It's just an antidote, but I mean... An item's an item. Help me check Route 20. That's... Uh, what do you think I'm doing, man? Found him! Okay, all things considered, though... Gen 5 has some of the best OST. What if not the best OST? Like this is these this music is a bop. Gonna go for magnitude again, see what we can get. Hopefully we don't flinch. Dude, I gotta stop opening my mouth, man. No crit. Magnitude eight, that should be an Oko. There we go, we take it. Is there gonna be one more out here? Going to Verbeek City. Bye. Okay, so, okay, so that was all I had to do, and now I get to go to the new town. Cool, cool, cool. Don't mind if I do. That is where I'm headed. And then I, we'll probably end the episode right when we get to Kitsali. A little bit of a shorter episode. But I mean, we, we did the plasma stuff, we got Pokestar Studios out of the way, we got the second gym badge, um, we almost died and had a heart attack, great times, good times, stressful times. And he's getting down on himself. Hey man, you're a better actor than me, I literally just hit A. Take me to Castellia, sir. I do not want to be on this side of the world anymore. I want to uh, travel and adventure. Show us that ship, you're so proud. Why do I see Gary slash Hugh, was it uh, his like uh, original name or whatever it was supposed to be? Why do I see him as just Bakugo? Hey! Oh, that's a horrible Bakugo. Never mind. I'm not even going to continue trying to do that. No. Nope. Nope. That's why I'm not a voice actor. Why I'm not a voice actor. Show us that ship you're so proud. No, that's not. Wow. That one. <laughs> there we go. Big old city. Big old city. Look at that. Max Potion, let's talk to some of these people on the dock, but otherwise we're gonna go, uh... Go heal up our Pokemon at the Pokemon Center. And call it good. This place is huge. Oh, hey, I'll take a bike. Why not? Okay. So we're gonna go heal, and then I'm gonna have to figure out what in the world we do after this point, because now this is starting to look confusing. No. That is, if you check the internet, you can register the place where you live. Oh, well, I don't care about that at all. Sorry. Okay, let's do some uh, healing up real quick. We'll buy some items. And then we'll probably call that an episode. Let's see if we... No, no, nothing really of use there. Got what? I'll buy, I'll buy seven more of these. Buy two more of these just to round that out. And we'll spend the rest on some super potions. Do I have... No, I, I wanted to sell. Thank you. 
I wanted to see if I had stuff to sell. Oh, this was when they started, uh, you can reuse those. They're not going to buy those. And I don't really have anything worth selling other than to a maniac, so I guess I'm not going to worry about that. I'm going to come out here. I'm going to save the game. Hopefully, if it did, if it doesn't save this time, I'm going to be so freaking mad. I'm going to check it right after this, just because, like, I, I need to know that it's saved. But... Anyways, this is going to be the end of the episode, so if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button down below, hit the subscribe button, and join the herd, and become one of the kids, hit the bell button to get notified whenever I upload a video, and if you want to be named after Pokemon, make sure you comment down below what you want that name to be, or if you just want to be named after you, but I will see you guys in the next video.